Ugh, look at my poor roof. Okay, today's video is a little bit different. And by the way, I'm in Houston, Texas right now. Um, all right, this incident takes place back in 2022 last year. I figured I'd tell the story on why and how, I guess why I had to replace my Tesla Y roof. So I'll run through all the cost and the reasons why. And uh, yeah, so let's go back to this video. I gotta rush back to the, pick up my family because I'm heading to the airport. We'll talk. Dude, this, what is this? Rust. It's not rust, man. It's rust. So, or whatever is at the edge of a hoist. If, look, know. it's like paint. Oil? No, it's like paint. There was so, paint. There was I don't know if you guys can see this. Thank you for all your concerns. Uh, there is a crack. The whole thing got cracked. So what happened, G? I got the car back from the valet in the New York parking lot. And me and the kids go in the car. And the kids look up and they scream. Because they see a crack and they see darkness. And they don't understand what's going on. And the valet got... Didn't know. The valet guy didn't know about it. Then he looked at it and he was like, oh my God, what happened? Because he's the guy, valet guy that I gave the car to, but I was there from Friday. So basically in a nutshell, she went to New York with the kit. Oh, that's my flight. Okay, let's try that again. Let's go back to what I was saying. So basically long and short, she drove down to New York, um, valeted her car for the weekend. And then when she came out, that's what happened. Kids saw everything, saw the roof smash. It was basically kind of the underground parking um, situation after that. One of the first things I did was check sentry mode, but it didn't really catch anything, but it just showed the underground of where the car was parked. Next steps was going into the app and requesting service to get my roof fixed, but um, they didn't do the in-house service at the time. So I had to go on their website and find a specified Tesla repair shop to get this done. So I chose Excellence Automotive. They had some great reviews online and I showed up at the shop the next day. Man, this shop is insane. All right, so the person that helped me out just pulled in the car and uh, it's pouring rain outside. And he's gonna give me the verdict of seeing what's the cost to fix this thing. Before I went outside to go look at the car, they were kind enough to give me a tour oh, of the yeah, facility. so cool. Should, you gotta take a look down yeah, here. Crazy. These hoods were painted by the owner. Come on. Yeah. Artist, the owner? Obviously. Well, he was. Uh, he started the business, you know, just doing regular body paint when Crazy. he was, you know, like young, right? Like back in the eighties. Yeah. Um, and then he just grew the business to this. Oh, dude, that's amazing. Operation, right? This shop. This is like one of the nicest. Oh man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I feel bad. My feet are wet. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, about you have theater, so. oh my god. My huge coffee guy. I need. Yeah, that's a nice machine. Do we figure out what that orange stuff is? Oh, it's spray paint. I don't get it. Like, so I think someone jumped on the car. No. No. Uh, or cracked it. What do you think? I don't know. Gate. Huh? Gate or a, a garage door? Oh, that was freshly painted. No, the gate garage door. Then they tried to cover it up with. I don't know why they. Why did they choose well, this? Because the glasses are. The glasses. When you're looking in the sunlight, the glasses are. Got a bit of red tinge to it. Gotcha. And they probably just spray can they spray bombed it. Spray bomb for sure. Doesn't um, make any sense. Yeah, it makes no sense whatsoever because you notice that. And this uh, wiping down the areas we touched. So. Oh my god, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. No problem. And I'm sorry the car's still dirty. My wife literally just got back from New oh, York. It's not a big deal. It's, it's like to wipe down what we touched. So you know, you get a clean car back even for an estimate. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you. No problem. Just the roof, you think? Yeah, cool. it's uh, well, there's stuff on the lift gate glass, but I don't know if it's related or not. It doesn't look like it's related. It's just some minor scratches, like regular stuff. I uh, notice, I don't know if, if this is just a body thing. I noticed, uh, yeah. right? So when my wife came back, that, that, oh, was, that, that hit something actually. This is right. I don't know if I can't, I don't know, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if, yeah, the piece is uh, is actually warped. So either like a parking block or something like that. Yeah. Something low. It's a hit. So because it's, it's actually bent in the it's bent the piece. This piece you can't bend back. It doesn't clip back in. Yeah, because it's, it's already bent. It's hit. So gotcha. you probably need to replace it. So it kind of makes sense that they use the red spray paint now. So here's an example of a Tesla that I found at a Costco parking lot uh, with that kind of red tingy roof. In a recent trip to New York, I actually went to the garage to talk to them and they showed me this is where the attendant backed in our Tesla and it engaged the roof height and hit the hoist slash the lift. 
So the bar took a few weeks to get here, so I decided to scrape off all the paint. So every time the kids get in, they wouldn't freak out by looking up and seeing that paint and damage. But they want to see something of sheer stupidity. So the guys also decided to paint the inside, I guess, at first. Because obviously the top part's all clear now, and when I'm going up to check the paint on the inside, it actually scratches off. So I don't know what they were thinking. Uh, Probably my interior too got messed up. Oh yeah, I guess there's pieces tear too. So I tried my best to go in there to film the removal of the roof and the install, but uh, timing totally didn't work out between my work schedule and I missed both opportunities to do this. But anyways, the job was done and it was a phenomenal, phenomenal job from uh, Excellence Automotive. So thank you to them. <laughs> no, no, all good. Where was the old glass? Probably right here. Oh man. Whew. So nice to be back to plus 25 weather versus the plus 46 that was in Texas. Okay, down to the dirty here. Um, information on cost. Apart from Tesla for the roof was $2,661.15. Labor was $1,576.35 with a grand total of $4,342.59, um, $4,342. And they did an amazing job. So thank you so much, Excellent Automotive. And thank you guys for watching the video if you stuck around this far. I really appreciate it, guys. And uh, till the next one, ciao.